Hello all, welcome to this session. In this session, I am going to answer one of the Selenium interview questions. That is, what are the differences between J-Behave and Cucumber? Let me answer. Both J-Behave and Cucumber are BDD frameworks. You can also call them as tools for implementing behavior-driven development methodology in our development projects or automation projects. They are tools or libraries which can be used for implementing behavior-driven development methodology in our development or automation projects. Okay, In simple terms, you can call them as BDD frameworks that you can use in your projects. So what is the difference? So in real time, if you ask me whether you have used JBehave or Cucumber, Cucumber is popular. Okay. Everyone uses Cucumber for implementing BDD in their automation projects as part of Selenium automation projects and all. When compared to JBehave, a lot of people use Cucumber. Cucumber is very famous, okay, in the market. But since the question is being asked to list down the differences between JBehave and Cucumber, let me list down some differences for you just for interview purpose, okay? To get this kind of question in the interview, you have to clearly mention that both are BDD frameworks. Okay, used for implementing the behavior driven development methodology in your development or automation projects. And uh, you have to next mention the line saying that compared to JBehave, Cucumber is very popular in the market. Everyone uses Cucumber. Nowhere I have seen someone using JBehave. Maybe people may be using, but in most of the projects, Cucumber is famous. Okay, for implementing BDD in the BDD in the projects. Okay, in Selenium automation projects. So coming to the differences for this question, the differences are language support. JBehave is primarily for Java programming, okay? Whereas Cucumber is not like that. Cucumber it can be used for uh, implementing uh, BDD in uh, Java projects, Ruby projects, JavaScript projects, and many, many other programming language projects, okay? It has multiple language support, whereas JBehave primarily for Java. Then writing style. The way you write the scenarios, okay, as part of BDD and all is different, is different from JBehave and Cucumber, okay? So these are the differences. Community support. So uh, JBehave is something old. Okay, it's coming from olden days. So such kind of community support is there. So from long time people following JBehave, such kind of community is there. Whereas coming to Cucumber, it has a lot of popularity in the market. Hence, very active and community support is there. Very active community support because it's currently popular in the market when compared to the JBehave and all. Cucumber is more popular. So active community support is there for Cucumber. Integration options. Both of them have good integration options. And execution flow also will be different from JBehave and Cucumber. The way you uh, uh, execute the flow of the code in JBehave is different from the way the code will be executed in the flow in Cucumber is different. So hope guys you got the difference between JBehave and Cucumber. Okay. So these differences are not that much uh, required, okay, for you to guys to understand. So let's not dig deep. Rather, you just mention when someone is asking you about the differences, language support, writing style, community support, integration, and execution flow, and mention that both can be used for BDD implementation projects. And but Cucumber is popular and is having very active community support nowadays. Okay, whether JBA is uh, from there from long time, okay. Uh, but also has good community support. But when compared to Cucumber, Cucumber is a popular. Okay. Like that if you give, that's enough. But uh, still, if the interviewer is expecting you for more, then mention all these points like language support, JBehave only Java, Cucumber multiple languages. Few of the differences if you mention, that's all good. Okay. To go. So that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye-bye.